Fuzzy legs, do you think you could secure those windows? And you'll alert me if anything scary comes close to the cottage? Shh. Oh, who am I kidding? When something scary comes close to the cottage? Please tell me my hiding place is ready. Oh, look. You filled it with everything I need to survive this awful night. Thank you. Thank you all. Now I don't have to step a hook outside until this whole thing is over. Oh, no. You don't have any carrots? Do we have any other fresh veggies you may enjoy? Or maybe some hay? But that means I'll need to go out. What? Nightmare night? My little pony, my little pony. Sure. Tons of fun. A beautiful heart, faithful and strong. Sharing kindness. It's an easy feat. And magic makes it all complete. You have mine. Do you know you are my very best friends? about. It's nightmare night, remember? How could I forget? Oh, I don't suppose I could borrow a few pieces of hay from you. I forgot to stock up on food for Angel, and you do seem to have quite a lot. We need it for the Apple Family Haunted Maze. The scariest maze that there ever was. Who knows what lurks inside? Oh, I'm sure I don't. Is that the mummified pony that just leaped out at you? I don't know. Is it? And what's that crunching sound beneath your hooves? Maybe it's the bones of ponies that didn't make it out alive. <laughs> bones? And are those pea or grapes? Or a thousand slimy eyeballs staring at you from beyond the grave? Please tell me they're grapes. Oh, I'll never tell. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I wonder what got stuck in her craw. Twilight? Hello? You think it's scary now? Just wait until it's done. That's okay. I'll take your word for it. Hey, wait a minute. It's nightmare night, and you're here and not holed up in your cottage. Does this mean what I think it means? That I foolishly forgot to stock up on food for Angel and had to go out to get him something but got spooked in town, so I came here hoping Twilight had some lettuce I could give him. Oh, I thought maybe you decided to come out with us tonight. Goodness, no. I couldn't be out tonight. I just couldn't. Technically speaking, you already are out right now. Oh, I guess that is true. So, what if you stayed out a little longer with your friends? I know they'd be super excited. You think so? You would make them so happy if you joined in. They wouldn't believe their eyes. Come on, Fluttershy. What do you say? And then, it got very, very quiet. And suddenly, they realized the balloons had never been in <laughs> Did I ever tell you about the night that the mannequin came to life and haunted all the costumes? What happened? 
I just told you, darling, a mannequin came to life, haunted all the costumes. <coughs> Hi, every pony. <coughs> Fluttershy, what are you doing here? Is everything okay? Everything is fine. In fact, it's more than fine. I've decided to join you in your nightmare night festivities. <laughs> Seriously? You? Out? Tonight? Every nightmare night, I shut myself in my cottage and refuse to come out until morning. But it's just like when I was afraid to sing in front of any pony. If I hadn't given it a try, I never would have found out how much I enjoy it. And we'd have missed out on how great you sound. Fluttershy with us on nightmare night? Why, that's positively the most wonderful news I've heard in ages. You can get dressed up in a costume with us and play nightmare night games with us and eat candy apples with us. Don't forget the best part. Going through my family's corn maze. Oh, right. The maze. Uh, only if you're up for it. Oh, I am. I am ready to take on Nightmare Night. Yay! Oh, awesome! Awesome! <laughs> <laughs> Just practicing. <laughs> Mummy? No. Headless Pony? No. Vampire Fruit Bat? Ugh, definitely no. You see, Fluttershy, the beauty of Nightmare Night is that you don't have to dress up as something scary. Ooh, yes! This one will look gorgeous on you. Period costumes are all the rage this year. What, no good? What if we encounter something terrifying and need to get away quickly? All those layers could slow me down, or worse, make me trip. Oh, I never considered that. Never fear. <laughs> oh, now this is a real stunner. I call it masquerade. Just a simple black dress underneath, but with this ornately decorated mask. A mask? No, they can just be so difficult to see out of. Yes, but this one has eye holes. What about being able to see what's to the left or right of me? I suppose your vision would be somewhat obscured. It's your first nightmare night out and about, and we do want you to be comfortable. What if I just wear the dress? Oh, sure, dear. That's fine. It's so plain, it's frightening. Oh, my, look at all of you. My costumes fit you to a T. Wait, we're gonna have the best time. Hey, Fluttershy, where's your costume? I'm wearing it. <gasps> I get it. You're a robber escaping into the night. You're a ninja escaping into the night. You're black licorice escaping into the night. Close. I'm going to a masquerade ball without the mask. Oh, that's great. Isn't it great? Oh, so great yeah. I figured I'd save the really scary games for next year when Fluttershy's more used to it. Round and round and round, and round you go. Where you stop, no pony knows. Okay, go! <laughs> Good luck beating that, Fluttershy. Well, um, it's just that if I'm blindfolded and some pony were to leap out in front of me, I'd never have the chance to defend myself. That's fine, darling. You don't have to do anything you don't want to. We're just glad you're here. We don't have to finish that game. I have another one I know you'll love. Bobby for Apple. <laughs> Fluttershy, what's wrong? It's just that, um, what happens if, when my head is deep down in the water, some kind of scary monster appears? How would I even hear to know I was under attack? Time for candy! It is? Look at candy bags! Each bag has been made with each of you in mind, complete with each of your favorite candies! <laughs> awesome! Here, take it, take it! What are you waiting for? Well, it's just, what if when I'm eating one of these chewy taffies, my mouth becomes glued shut and I can't scream for help? Oh, good 
goodness. We've only just started to celebrate Nightmare Night together, and I'm already taking all the fun out of it, aren't I? You're not taking out all the fun. Just like 90 per... Some of it. I really want to do this, but there's just so many things that terrify me about tonight. I couldn't possibly predict what might upset me. <laughs> Unless... You were the one doing the scaring. Her scaring us? <laughs> oh, you're being serious. The thing you hate is being scared. But if you're the one doing the scaring, then... Then I can help you all have fun, and I can still be a part of Nightmare Night. So, you like that idea? I think I do. And I don't want to get ahead of myself but I think I have the perfect idea for how I'm going to do it. Really? Ah, oh, this is so exciting! Meet me at my cottage in an hour. Oh, I'm excited to see every pony soon. <laughs> Welcome to Fluttershy's Tea Party. Did she just say tea party? It sounds like it's a scary tea party. <sighs> Have a seat. Don't be scared of what awaits you. Go on, pass the sugar. Oh no, there is none. You're a terrible host. Rarity, put your coat on. Why would I do that? You need to cover up because no one has complimented your dress. Pinkie Pie, look to your left and ask your best friend to pass the cucumber sandwiches. Huh? I can't. There's no pony there. That's right, because she didn't care to show up. What? A friend who didn't come through. That must scare you to the core. Quick, every pony, look behind you. Uh, what are those? They're unplanned guests. Your worst nightmare. You don't have enough food for them. Oh no, there's a tiny kitten that needs a home. But you are overscheduled right now. You don't have time to help. I said... You don't have time to help. This should appear to scare you. Why don't you look terrified? You showed up to a party and every pony was extremely disappointed in you. Can you imagine anything more upsetting? It was a really good try, darling. But the scares at Nightmare Night are of an entirely different nature. It was really creative, though. I never would have thought of uh, all this. Oh, I'm just not cut out for this. Just go on without me. Oh, no, we couldn't possibly. You have to. This is the night you look forward to all year. We could stay here? It's okay. I really want you all to have fun. This is how I spend every nightmare night. Please, go. I'll be fine. Eh, it's funny. I actually thought she had an idea for something really scary for a second there. She definitely tried her hardest. I did try my hardest. Or maybe not. I suppose I could have gone with something a bit scarier. You're right. I've been taking baby steps. I think it's time for grown-up ones. I don't suppose you have any ideas how I could do that? Every pony's lining up for the corn maze, y'all. Let's go! Oh, yeah! I can't believe we're finally doing this! <laughs> it's a good thing Fluttershy isn't here, because she would never be able to handle this.
Bunch of dried sticks painted white to me. Hey, try to keep up the illusion, would ya? ever scared because I wasn't. I'm a pretty good actress when I want to be. Granny? Applejack, didn't you know about any of this? All right. I got to admit I didn't know about any of this, but maybe they're just trying to make it interesting for me, too. I'm sure Granny Smith or Big Mac is behind this. I don't feel great arrival staring at you from beyond the grave. <laughs> yep. Ah! That's what we were supposed to do. I don't know why we're down here. This is really scaring me now. <laughs> if I could try to make the maze even scarier for my friends. You came up with all of this? I had some help. Angel was the scary figure that kept scurrying after you in the maze. Fuzzy Legs made the sticky wall that made it difficult for you to see and move. And of course, Harry was the especially scary monster. Wow, that was inspired. You have to do this every year! 
Oh, yes, yes, every year. Oh, yeah. We could celebrate Nightmare Night together every year, but the truth is I really don't want to. You don't? But you've done it. You found a way that we can all have a fabulous time together. Yes, but I've also realized something. You all may love Nightmare Night, and I may be good at being a part of it, but it's no fun for me to see my friends feel like they're in danger, even if I know they're not. I really don't like it. It's just not my cup of tea. Spooky tea? No, just regular tea. We do lots of fun things together, but I'm afraid this just isn't gonna be one of them. Actually, I'm not afraid. I'm perfectly fine with it. Then we are too. <sighs> I don't know why I doubted myself for a second. Now this is what I call a perfect nightmare night. <laughs> 